a new evolution of robotic suits literally fuses man with machine. So let's dive into the evolving field and look at 5 epic creations. At number 5, the ominous prothesis. Developers of the anti-robot had a vision. Build a giant robot suit which would participate in an elite racing league. That dream is starting to become a reality as the 14 foot tall 3 ton robot is currently in its late phase of development. It is built out of electrohydraulics and it's controlled through the pilot's arms movements. The machine can theoretically run up to 20 miles per hour and it will last over 30 minutes per charge. There has not been a lot of video footage proving that the prothesis is a workable concept which proves that it's truly something to be fearful of. So we'll just have to wait and see until this robot starts powering its way through the racetrack. At number 4, the Mark III Power Jacket. Debuted in a bizarre commercial, the Mark III is an empowering mecha suit. It towers in at over 8 feet tall, but it's still a light duty suit and it can only carry 9 pounds. The Mark III can also surprisingly move very fast, and it's quite easy to learn. So the coolest thing about the suit is that its arms are motorized and are accurately controlled through joysticks by the user. But it also has a huge price tag of around $100,000 and it's in very limited supply. So only the rich will be able to afford this really expensive robotic suit. Which is probably a good thing because if I ever bought one, I'd probably arm it with swords and laser beams. At number 3, the Kratos. The ultimate war machine is 4 tons of carnage which can go up to 6 miles per hour. It can freely move its legs, torso, and even arms, making it one of the most enhanced robot suits ever built. The pilot also has a connect-based visual input, along with a touchscreen interface for identifying and striking targets on the battlefield. So far, no devastating weapons have been installed on the Kratos. And oddly enough, its BB Gatling gun, which can shoot 6,000 rounds per minute, only works if you start smiling. The machine also costs around a million dollars, but hey, if I had the choice, I would probably buy this epic machine of terror over a supercar any day. At number 2, the Megabots Mark II. Mechwares are finally becoming reality thanks to the hardworking team over at Megabots. The Mark II is a 15 foot tall, 6 ton machine of devastation. It can throw objects at over 130 miles per hour, twist its torso, and even fire interchangeable weapons. The newer Mark III is also being built to be a fully walking mech, which will have the power of lifting over 2,500 pounds. It's already proven this by lifting a car with ease, and it will likely be far more impressive than the Mark II. And who knows, it can even evolve into a mobile weapon for the military. But a company in Korea has also claimed to build the first true walking mechware, which brings us to number one. At number one, the Method 1. This giant robot has exceeded many boundaries and has gone into a new frontier of robotic suits. It was so groundbreaking that some skeptics even believe that it's not real. But the company which has built the giant suit has also worked in the field of robotics for several years. And I'm going to bet on that this ultimate machine is real. The legs have rotating angle joints which allow the robot to walk. And it also has arms which move in correlation with the pilot. The machine of devastation is still a work in progress, but the 13 foot tall, 1.5 ton robot has taken over $200 million to develop. And there's already been a huge amount of interest in using the suit for a variety of industries. The developer hopes to sell newer versions by 2018 for a starting price tag of around $8 million. So once again, thanks for watching, please like the video and subscribe to my channel.